Hello, everybody. Ignore that I look like shit. It's just since my operation, I've only worn makeup once. Um, as you can see, there's a little little puppy in the background that has the mega zoomies. And I wanted to tell you uh, a little bit about her story, actually. Excuse you. We got the zoomies. <laughs> I'll show you the... Hello? Hello? <laughs> I feel like she's still just learning her legs, so she doesn't quite know how to handle the zooms yet, do you? Ready? There you go. <laughs> um, yeah, she is just under eight weeks old at the moment. So I just wanted to, as I said, I want to talk to you about her story. So um, I found her on Gumtree and I was looking for... Uh, like a rescue dog or a dog that had been like pre-loved that sort of thing and I never expected to find a dog like as young as her that wasn't going to be like thousands of pounds and like a purebred dog you know so I messaged Zoe's owner and she was the only girl wasn't you you was the only girl in the litter this is her <laughs> she's got she's normally like a sweet little angel but at the moment you're being very naughty you're being very naughty because you want to play. Ow. Ow. Uh, yeah, so she was the only girl in the litter. So I was like, I want her. And to be fair, I was one of those people that would like message dog people constantly. Um, just have feelers and see if I can find like the right sort of dog for me. And I was really struggling. But there was something about Zoe's profile really because <laughs> I, I, I like I think it's because she's so different and unique and like I don't know what sort of dog she is uh, I've just sent off for a DNA test today so we're gonna find out what you are oh we? we're gonna find out who you are uh, and I think there's like some Labrador and Collie potentially there could be German Shepherd as well uh, excuse me eat your thing not me um yeah she's going through the I've got the mega zooms, meaning you're going to have mega nap later, but you've got Harriet picking you up. Um, yeah, and her mum was a rescue. Sorry. Oh, no. Um, her mum was a rescue. So she, her mum was found on a beach. Hello. And she was like really emaciated and then she got pregnant. Uh, had the four. She was the only girl, as I said. And I was like, I have to have her. Excuse No, 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 no. That's my arm. Eat the camera, please. She's having like the biggest zoomies. Can you? No! Hello! She is being a little nightmare. She's normally okay, actually. She, I, I make out like that she's being the worst dog ever. She's actually quite lovely. Um, let me prop you somewhere where we, I can talk properly. <laughs> Will it sit? Okay. So, yeah, I. I traveled three hours to get her. I was like on Zoom with the owner for a week getting updates and stuff and just seeing how she's growing. And I was like, I have to get this dog. Like I don't have any form of man. I don't have um, like a job that needs me all of the time, especially with like TikTok and stuff. I can reduce my hours at work now. So it means I've got way more time for a dog. And I've always had a dog in my life. So she needs to go. Bless you. It's the weirdest sneezes I've ever heard. Um, yeah, so I travelled three hours. I think I took two trains and a bus. So I went to Southampton uh, near Hyde from London and then back. And she slept like the whole time. She's been so good as well. So she's only um, like, she's been with me two nights now. So. I got her in the evening. She basically slept the whole time. And then she went in a crate without like a peep. She was so good. And then um, last night was like the first full like day. And again, she was amazing. She has not made a noise. She's not had an accident. She's like currently running around the garden. So she's getting more confident as time's going on. Uh, and it's good that she's having a run around because Harriet's gonna have her for today. Uh, because I'm going to work. The only sad thing is, is like, I've got work tomorrow and there's no one to have her. So it'll be the first day that she's like on her own for a couple of hours, but- Hello, hello, come here. 
Um, yeah, so she's <laughs> she's such a good girl. You are, you're having the mega zooms, which is great. You've got little wet toes. You do. <laughs> We've just done the DNA test as well. So I'm going to send that off today. Well, Harriet's going to send it off for me. So in two weeks, we're going to find out exactly who you are, um, as I said before. Uh, and I'm just like really excited to see how she grows and is she gonna be like the size of a Great Dane or is she gonna be Cocker Spaniel size? Like I have no idea, but I am so excited to see like how she is. Uh, and I think basically she's gonna be like a therapy dog for me. She's gonna be so good for my mental health, uh, especially because like I have Jack and Harriet, but they have jobs and stuff and I do have other friends as well but everybody has like commitments. And uh, so I need something to like really kind of get me up because otherwise on my days off, I will just spend the whole day in bed doing absolutely nothing. And I don't want to do that. I want to actually like go out and take myself on dates and stuff and be really positive. So I want to do like a series where uh, I do go on dates with her and like adventures and what. I'm so sorry I keep like doing the whole like dog parent thing. I feel like I'm doing a good job. I feel like we're doing okay, but um, yeah, I'm really enjoying her. I, I feel like she's such a good girl. <laughs> I just heard you burp. Excuse me, that's not for you. That's not for you. Zooby zooby I promise this account is not just going to be dog spam, it's just because I'm excited because it's a new puppy. Uh, I will be posting different types of videos as well. It's just like, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Like, she's so sweet. I've completely forgot to mention as well. Uh, on the bus back, Zoe was being really good. She was being super sleepy, uh, just being such a good girl. Then this like hand comes up behind me and like leans over and I had my earphones in and I was like, oh, you made me jump because I'm a very jumpy person. And it was like a guy and he said, oh, I'm a dog person. Can I say hello? I was like, yeah, that's fine. He went, do you make TikToks? I said, yeah. And then he went, I know who you are. And it was so weird because he, he asked for a picture with me. So I was like, okay, I'll, I'll take a picture with you. And it's like, I took a picture with a stranger because I knew, like they knew who I was. So having like fan experiences, I've had them at work, but never like really out in the wild. So that was such a strange experience, but he was really nice. And I think he understood that like I was traveling quite a bit and I was really tired. But uh, if you're watching this, hi. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> I'm gonna leave the vlog here um, because I've got Harriet coming over in like 10 minutes and I don't want to, to vlog her uh, just because I want to like, you know, I, I like to have time with her without this like content life. Uh, but I hope you guys like her as much as I do. And uh, yeah, just remember to like, comment and subscribe.